Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to share with you actually how to get a teaching job in South Korea. South Korea is a, a very good place actually for teaching English or Russian, Japanese, maybe some other languages like French, German. You can come to Korea and teach the language actually. So, but mostly people are focusing on teaching English language to Koreans. So, if you are eligible and if you know that you are good at teaching English, so Korea is a good place for you. Even if you think that you're not good at teaching English, if you practice, if you work on it for like two months or three months, just attend free classes online or some kind of, um, kind of free courses, I think you can learn it. It's not that difficult. Okay. There's so many job, job available actually for native speakers plus Indians. I can say that, okay, India is also listed as a, a native English speakers and you can teach if you're an Indian, you can teach in South Korea, English language. Okay. There are four ways actually that you can apply for the jobs and you can get a good job in South Korea and start teaching English to Korean kids. Okay. Let's go to the first one. But before I go to the first one, I just request you guys to hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, so you can watch my new videos. And if you have any specific question, comment below. And if it, if you need in like a detailed answer, so I think you better email me. Well, guys, the first one is called EPIC. EPIC, like um, E P I K. I think it stands for yeah English program in Korea. Okay. So, if you want to teach English in South Korea, you have to be in one of the following countries like Australia, Canada, Ireland, New Zealand, United Kingdom, United States or South Africa and India if you have a bachelor degree in English education. Yes, you can teach in South Korea at schools so, yeah, or English academies. And EPIC is, uh, I think this is the government website. So you can just check out this website. Then there are some required documents that you need to fill the application for and prepare the documents. They don't need any specific document. Of course, they need your bachelor degree. And also they need, um, I, I think TESOL, TEFL, these certificates are not really required. If you are from one of the mentioned countries <clears throat> but still yeah, you need to be like mentally and physically healthy not to be sick you know and uh, good command on english language and have the ability and willingness actually to adapt the korean culture and lifestyle you know sometimes people are coming and they're expecting koreans to be an englishman or a canadian no so you have to adapt to korean culture so you have to be a Korean when you're living in South Korea. Okay. And also if you're a Korean living in the US or in one of the mentioned countries, yes, you can also come back to Korea and teach as an English teacher in English schools or high school or middle school or even elementary schools actually. So this is a government website actually, valid. There's no fee, so you can just apply through these, this website, then you can get the teaching job. It's easy, not difficult. The second one is talk program. What is talk program? Okay, let me just, yeah. Talk program is a very good program. If you're a student in uh, one of the developed countries, like uh, as I mentioned, like Canada, United States, New Zealand, Ireland, Australia, South Africa, or India, and TALK is a program actually that if you finish two years of your undergraduate program and you are tired or maybe you don't have that energy you know, to continue, so you want to take a break maybe for six months or one year, like one semester or two semesters, you can apply for this program, come to Korea, teach English. Yes, they also pay you 1,500,000 uh, Korean won, so, but it is a little bit less paid than EPIC program. Because this is some kind of, um, okay, it's a short-term program. 
And also you're teaching not many hours, just uh, maybe 15 hours per week, something like that. But EPIC program is a full-time work. This is not a full-time, this is a part-time work. Okay, guys, this uh, talk program is also a very good program. So you can just um, come to Korea and teach English to English schools or high school, middle school, or so the small academies. This is the second. And the third one is Office of Education in different cities. They are hiring English teachers from the mentioned countries to come to Korea and get a job. So you can just uh, apply through like uh, the websites. For example, one is like GOE and other Office of Education in other cities actually. They are also hiring English teachers. So you can apply and get uh, a job, then come to Korea, then so of course English academies or if it is English academy you will contact them. So mostly English academies are paying for your air uh, tickets and also for insurance, housing. And there are some benefits like uh, maybe two weeks vacation, also one month extra salary if you teach for a year. So it's good actually. And also, Korea is a place that you will not miss. You will not be homesick. So you will enjoy. This is a fun place. This is the third way actually that you can uh, come to Korea and start teaching English. And the fourth one is direct applying to academies. There are so many English academies. Maybe in every uh, province in South Korea, maybe there are thousands. Yeah, maybe. In total, maybe, so there are four or five provinces in South Korea. So, yeah, of course, more than 5,000 academies are already in South Korea. So you can contact them, of course, then send them your CV. So it's not really competitive, you know. They need English teachers. And if you're from India, fulfill the requirements, apply for the job. Then compared to India, the income is really high, so you can come to Korea, start teaching English, then that's really good, guys. Okay, and uh, direct applying is also not really difficult. So the salary range, maybe it's a little different because when you're teaching at high school in South Korea, so the salary is kind of fixed. It's, oh, it's not really fixed. It starts from 2 million Korean won to 2.7 million uh, plus the benefits, you know. But sometimes there are some schools and... Uh, especially English academies, private English academies, they are paying higher, like 3 million, 3.5 million they are paying you. It all depends on the hours that you are teaching in South Korea. But if you are teaching as a part-time English teacher, so probably the uh, payment is different because it's part-time, so you can get paid like 50 or 60,000 Korean won, something like $50 or $55 per hour. And also there are business English classes that they are paid really well and also there are like professional English classes that you can teach and also you can get paid really well. If you're a professional um, English teacher like for example in a specific area for example health or for example business for example marketing you can go to the companies and teach their employees English and you're gonna get paid something like more than four thousand five thousand dollar even. Yes, there is an American company in South Korea that I contacted them. They were looking for an English teacher and they said that they are going to pay $100 for an hour. So if you go there four times a week, so just in the morning before the employee starts their work, so you can just teach them an hour English, then just come back to your home. So you're going to get paid like $1,600, like $1,600 per month. Yes, and if you have two, three classes per day, of course, you're going to get paid something like $5,000 per month. That's really good, you know. Professional English teachers are paid really well in South Korea. Like at least, at least I can say that, okay, an hour is going to be $50 or $55. Okay, well, guys, these are um, the ways actually that you can start teaching in South Korea. And uh, for more detailed, please um, comment below. And if you want to ask more questions, talk to me, email me. And uh, okay, guys, see you in the next video. Thanks and have a good day.